Hello guys, Keep Right on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And if you haven't already, make sure to drop a sub. So it's finished at Bramall Bram Lane. Sheffield United won, Birmingham City won. Brilliant point for Blues, and I was slated for saying a point would feel like three, but after going 1 0 down, it does feel like three points, doesn't it? What a performance from Blues. We're showing massive signs of improvement now under John Eustace. Uh, and we're showing as well that we can actually take on the big teams in the championship. Sheffield United being top and, uh, you know, we managed to get points out of them at their place as well. Um, the lineup, uh, we went with a back five again. First, um, looking at the, the starting eleven, my first thoughts were this is going to be a 4-4-2. But it wasn't. Ruddy in gold, Longello as a left wing back. And then we had uh, Colin playing as a right side centre back, Trusty Sanderson. And um, then we had Jordan Graham playing as a right wing back. The three in the middle, Bakuna, Chong, Bielik, and then Hogan and Deeney up top. Now, the first half, was it Sheffield United playing really poorly or just our defence being really organised? Because in that first half, even we really didn't have any chances to score. The first half was pretty boring, to be honest. The second half, of, of course... It livened the game livened up a bit. Sheffield United took the lead. Oliver McBurney scoring um, via a set piece. The ball just fell to him, fell to him in the box. Nothing, no one really was at fault for that goal in my opinion. And he just smashes it past John Ruddy, rifles it into that um, far right corner. John Ruddy, yeah, again can't blame John Ruddy for that. Um, you know, it was an unstoppable shot. Um, but we make it 1-1. We make it 1-1. Chong puts a ball into the box and it just drops kindly, perfectly for Troy Deeney. There's no way he can miss that. And it's 1-1. Deeney's first goal this year, by the way. Jesus, I never thought I would see the day again that Troy Deeney scores for Blues. But you know what? There was chances, a couple of chances for Blues and for Sheffield United to win the game. Um, you know, George Hall, I thought, you know, he could have done a bit better when he had the ball in the penalty box. Jude Be uh, not Jude Bellingham, sorry. Joe Bellingham giving the ball away and it led to a Sheffield United counter-attack. And um, Billy Sharp, geez, I would have lost my mind if he scored against us. But it was a brilliant save from John Ruddy. And I loved the way he was passing the ball as well. We were much more... I'm re I'm actually really, really excited, you know. When John Eustace was first appointed, I was like, this is a panic appointment. But look look at the improvements. Bielik is an absolute monster, by the way. Trusty Sanderson, brilliant centre-backs. In the first half, there was a, there was a moment where uh, Sanderson, brilliant, brilliant block. So, yeah, it's finished 1-1 at Sheffield United. I went for a 2-1 loss, but you know what? We've That's four and beaten now. Four and beaten. After losing to Norwich, we've gone to Preston and won. We've beaten West Brom. We've got a 0-0 draw against Coventry, and we've got a 1-1 draw against Sheffield United. What a run that... What a run, what a run Blues are on. I mean, under Boyer, trust me, un, under Boyer, we probably would have lost to West Brom, the Coventry, and to Sheffield United, to be fair. But you know what? Onwards and upwards, uh, Middlesbrough... Wednesday night, they're in the bottom three. They lost again, didn't they? You know what? I fancy our chances of winning that game. And uh, you know, you know what? Who knows what can happen this season? The thing is, we're improving, and that's you know, that's all all I want to see really. I want to see improvements, and uh, you know, this season hopefully it's looking like it can be a better season than the previous seasons that we've had. Anyway, let's see if we could wanted to like. Let me know what you thought of the game this afternoon. Anyways, be keep right on TV here. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep right up.